Screw you, Dallas Stars. Honestly, screw off. I was done. My day was over. I was happy. You know what? I sat there and I went, you know what? The last video was so nice. It's actually doing okay numbers. I didn't have to sit in a freaking crevice for it. It was so good. Day's going awesome. And then, bang. Dallas Stars, two-year deal, Kyle Capobianco. Screw you. Hmm. Okay. Whatever. I liked Kyle Capobianco. And guess what? You should have liked Cap Kyle Capobianco, too. He was the AHL Defenseman of the Year. The whole league. He's the best. Um, he didn't fit into the roster. So he was originally an RFA. But because he didn't get into the minimum games required, which was like under 10, he became a UFA. It's a complicated thing. Basically, it's just so that it's basically so that RFAs don't get abused and have to sit through meaningless um, contracts when they're not being utilized. Ironic, isn't it? Um, but yeah, no, this is this is a fun spot for him. Uh, Dallas's defense kind of oh, a little. It's a little more open. They're they're losing Tanev. They're losing Hockenpah. There's a couple openings there for sure. Um. But I don't know how this, I don't know what this does. You know what I mean? Like it, it definitely opens up a lot of spots on the moose. And you know what? There's a part of me thinking, you idiot. This is the Solomonson spot opening up on the Manitoba moose. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's fun. That's fun. Would have liked him to be there though. Because like at this point, the moose have lost one of their top scoring forwards. Their leading point getter on defense and uh, uh, identity line guys, and a couple guys throughout the roster. This Moose team is gonna be different. This Manitoba Moose team could be bad. Like, really bad. Um, which does matter, because you don't want your, your goaltending prospect, Thomas Miller, to get shelled 50 shots a night every night. So there's that. Uh, it's annoying It's that it's a division rival in Dallas. Good for Kyle. Um, he definitely deserved a contract, and... I thought that it was probably going to be a day two contract, but you know what? They snuck it in day one. They said, hey, Zach, guess what? Here's video number 10. It's a long day. It's been a long day. I'm probably going to have to make an 11th video today because that's just the world we live in. Thank you so much for watching. Please check out all 10 videos. They're under four minutes long, except for like one. Uh, please leave a like because we appreciate that and it means a lot to us. Um, subscribe. For everyday Jets content. Well, not every day. Well, there's not everything. There's not news every day. But all the time Jets content. We'll cover it. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you next time.